Hello YouTube, Film Buff 06 here, and in this video, I am very fucking excited to be giving you guys my live reaction to some of the results of the National Television Awards 2016. And, um, all that's really left for me to say is, I hope you enjoy the video, and let's get our fingers crossed for what should hopefully be a very exciting night tonight. <laughs> As far as I can remember, I voted for Doctor Who. So, but I have to admit, I've got this really terrifying feeling in my gut that Downton Abbey is going to win this year. I hope that doesn't happen. But honestly, if, but honestly, I would be happy if either Doctor Who or Broadchurch takes this award. Good evening, um, everybody. So, yeah. But the let's for just Grand see what Mahara. happens. Let's 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 try to think positive. Broadchurch. Not guilty. No. Uh, Your Honour, sorry, um, can I just ask for the indictment to be put again? Come on, Joe! You know what happened? Sit down! What do you say, Dad? I should kill him. He'll be dead in a minute. What difference does it make? Kill him and you make an enemy of me. Well... Well, let's see what happens, shall we? Oh, Stevens here, the Scottish prick. <laughs> Casualty. Um, okay, Lofty. Let me take over. Other way, back down. Yep. Jack, we're taking you somewhere quiet. Right, whilst we have Mr. Fairhead stable, I want him in the cat lab. Okay. Rita, call them, please. Rita, did you okay. hear me? Casualty. Cal. It's been it's been pretty good this year, casualty. Has. And together here in the sight of God and in the face of this congregation to join together this man and this woman in holy matrimony which is an honorable estate instituted of God in the time of man's innocency and therefore is not by any to be enterprised nor taken in hand unadvisedly lightly or wantonly if any man well, can show but, any but, just but cause thankfully it's, why it's the final series, it's the final together, time that, let him speak that this, that Downton is going to after, win the drama forever. if it, if it oh, does yes. this year. So, let's just see what happens, shall we? 
And the National Television Award goes to... To Broadchurch. Downton Abbey. I knew this was going to happen. I really didn't. Didn't want it to, but... But... Uh, this is a very special night for us. It's oh the last God. possible time we could the have won, Doctor so you'll be grateful who, for that. The Doctor Who haters I are going to, to have one to our wonderful one writer, Julian hell of Fellows, for giving us actors. Day. Wonderful lines so, to say I mean, and great characters. I mean, and, and they're going to say stuff like, oh my stage, god, the quality of Doctor Who has uh, now Nigel gone Martin, way down the Chris toilet Kratcher. thanks to uh, Mark. Particularly tonight, I want to say thank you to ITV for having uh, brought us along all this way, and in particular to one person, Peter Fincham, who is leaving Jesus. ITV soon, but he has guided us from the very start. And he's allowed our producers to create the show. This is terrifying. Take into your heart. This so thank is you to terrifying Peter and good luck for the future. Job to her because, and just because to say thank you I, to I you don't for know and for watching. Uh, because I it's don't know if it is if it is down to the quality of the show as um, it is yes, now. It, why, so the rate, um, so why the rate um in terms of why the ratings um went down this year. I love happy endings. And this is a very Happy or, Thank you. Or, or maybe it's time that we that we that we got a new show, and I'm going to get in, get more um, um get more in depth oh, oh, into Stephen well, Moffat's talk for just a second. as head writer uh, of, any, of do, as head writer of Doctor Who so far in, of in an in an upcoming Lovely discussion. Party. Someone actually has to actually make them. That's someone so, is none other than sculpting's Alphonse Tarrida. <laughs> Thomas Fatterini, thank you so much, Thomas. Really good. 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 Really Come and and tell the truth. Tell me, Mark. Uh, I'm kind. Let's and find out. The Immaculate, Mr. Lee Mack. And I seem to remember voting for I'm a Celebrity this year. Um, but, but personally, I'd be happy if either that or Saturday Night <coughs> Takeaway takes it. The Just National Television anything Awards that has anti death in it, I would be happy recognizing the talents of amazing versatile actors to have won incredibly hard working and skilled drama writers and wonderfully visionary directors. Just please let it happen. But every now and again you just want to give a trophy to two little Geordie blokes for encouraging grade F celebrities to eat a camel's testicle. <laughs> Yeah, he's results, talking obviously. to you Although guys. Although all the clues are there because uh, they have started fashioning this trophy in the shape of a camel's penis. But... <laughs> so the nominations for entertainment programme are... The Graham, the Graham Norton, Norton Show. show. Well, what do we have to do? I'm going to do a shout of myself. I'd be, I'd be surprised if that go from It'll be a person. surprise okay. if Graham Norton show wins. We're on a Graham Norton show, and I have some friends. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Quick, I'll be back. As the lady stand oh, me. There is no bathroom. <laughs> You're dumb, and then... You're dirty now. And what did you do? Your clothes. Oh, not obscene. Give them to me. No. Put that cookie down. No! Except. I am a celebrity. Get, Get me out of here. Just two minutes left now, Fern. Just, the just either I'm a celebrity day, day, or Saturday want, night don't take don't away. Yeah, don't Please. Don't it's going to strangle me, I know it. Guys. You're absolutely fine. You're absolutely fine. <laughs> don't worry. It's around my neck. Yeah. Everyone can see you. I'm doing a Britney Spears. 
<laughs> 40 jungle pythons and two carpet pythons in there. You've just got to stick it out now, okay? Celebrity juice! No, please. Please. It's never been done before because it's f stupid. <laughs> <laughs> what is this Jimmy doing? What the hell? Saturday night, take a while. One million pounds. One million pounds. What do you reckon it would be worth now? And what do you reckon it would be worth now? It should be north of three million at least. Three million pounds. Three million pounds. Run around the little island going, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> This is this is brilliant. That this is brilliant. Oh, this is brilliant. Oh my god. And the national television award goes to. So, please. I'm a celebrity. Yeah. Well done, well done, boy. Graham Singh Tappy there. We have the best, best time doing this show. Um, we'd like to thank, of course, all of the vain old goats for doing it. Um, we'd like to thank all of the chippy oiks that voted. Um, we'd love to thank um, all of the production team, ITV, for your continued support. But mostly, of course, um, the kangaroos of Australia who give their bodily parts so freely. Uh, <laughs> the show. Thank you, yes. thank you for watching. Thank you to everybody who voted for the show. We love doing the show. I think the last word should go to Rain and Queen of the Jungle, Vicky Patterson. Vicky? Yeah! Um, as I walked up the stairs and just gave us a word of advice, and that was please don't swear. <laughs> um, I'm super nervous, but I just want to say thank you to everybody who worked on the show. There's a huge, huge crew and cast. And thank you to everybody who voted. This is amazing. Uh, I don't feel like I deserve it, but they do. Thank you. You all deserve it. You all deserve this award. Well done. Okay, guys. It's um, it's new drama now. And Maisie Williams, yes, a shielder herself. Has the just, for new AKA drama. Lady oh. May has just come onto the stage. Um, and Hello. I vote, I'm I remember voting for humans. I'm not talking about user Joseph Hawkins. Um, a DNA sample will be taken for identification I've got a feel, I've, I've somehow got a feeling that Poldark is going to take this, but, um... Hello, Joe. I'm now securely bonded to you but as my primary user. It's very nice. Let's see what happens. That means she's ours. Okay. Yay! Right. Now what do we do? Ordinary lies. Never watched. Okay, Kathy ne so never showed much Marcy, interest in it, actually. Who is it? You know you're on a final warning. It's, it's, it's my wife. She, she, she died last night. Very suddenly, 
I'm really sorry, I, I won't be in today. Can you tell Mike? Mm. Of course. Marty. That's terrible, I'm so sorry. <sighs> Dr. Foster. Well, either that or Dr. Foster, really. Well, either humans or Dr. Foster, actually. So... This is one of... This is apparently one of the best scenes in television history this past year. It's okay. You're a bitch. Bitch is right. And this I'm a wolf dinner tonight. conversation. You mean you've been sorry, Susie, but your daughter's not a little girl anymore. You can ask my husband. Hold up. Yeah. Haven't really shown much interest in Polder in this no. new. Incarnation of Pole Dark, to be honest, but for some, for some strange reason, I mean, I don't really know. I don't really know what it is, but maybe it's Aiden Turner. But I don't know. Let's see what happens. And the National Television Award goes, goes to... to... Dr. Foster. Oh, wow! Ha! Ah. Well done. Saran looks like she's pregnant. I mean, that is that is fantastic. Oh wow! Are you alright, Bertie? Oh, why the hell did I pass up this 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 shot? Why the hell did I pass up this show last year? I'm looking for Snyder's. Yeah, I you should. Um, uh, this is amazing. I think everyone behind me and the amazing, talented... I'm lost Past for words. Now I just. Dr. Foster. Now I'm gonna. Now I'm gonna have to. Common, which was that we knew Mike Bartlett had written an Sorry. amazing drama. What we didn't know was I'm whether lost or not for what? other people would agree. I really, yeah. Um, so now I'm now I'm gonna buy um now I'm gonna buy Doctor Foster Bacon. series one on um, DVD and review you. it because thank you for voting for us. This is just amazing. Oh wow! We start filming uh, Doctor Foster series two in September, so we look forward oh, to wow. seeing you. Oh wow! Ah. Ah. Well done. Now, best daytime show now. And I think I voted for the chase to win this one. I know Anton Deck win everything, but the mic's all to be But really, it's between either that or the Jeremy Khan show for me. I mean. Ah. I couldn't be happy two of my, my, my favourite you know, shows at the moment. Two right, of my favourite daytime you know, shows at the moment. So, um, yeah. That's alright, there was enough cheering. Um, I'm very excited. It's my first, my first date night with Susanna. Date night for Piers, fright night for me. <laughs> it can't be like having a date with the devil, um, in my opinion. The chase! Yay! Pointless. Oh, 
Christmas. Don't watch much of it. The Paul O'Grady Show. Mm -hmm. The Jeremy Kyle Show. Yeah. And the National Television Award goes, goes to, to the Chase. Yes. Thank you. This is here, the vixen is here, and oh, the dark destroyer isn't here. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Right, I'll say a few quick words before the star of the show speaks. Um, there are lots and lots of people to thank for this. Uh, we have an amazing team who are behind this show. Some of, a few of us are here, a few are up there, slightly more drunk than us. Um, so much to thank them. This year we're going to film and transmit our 1000th show and it's been a fantastic time for us. We love making this show and the team work really, really hard, but we couldn't do it without the support oh. of ITV, Helen Warner and her fantastic team, Peter Fincham, we're going to miss you Pete, <laughs> David Berg and all the management mm -hmm. at ITV Studios who support all of us at Potato who just try our hardest to make this show. But now, I'm going to hand over to the star, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Bradley Walsh. Yay! Thank you. Thank you very much, it's very kind. I was very lucky to be in the grazing road, having a cup of tea, when I rang the controller daytime and said, can I have a meeting? She said yes, I went up in the lift and she showed me a format, and Mike and I have been here since the day it was born. We're thrilled with this. Thank you very much for voting. We really do appreciate it. God bless. Lots of love. Have a wonderful night. Thank you very much indeed. Oh. I'm fucking, fucking happy about this. Wow. Yes. Okay. Best entertainment presenter, guys. And... Let's hope Anton Deck win this again. Mr. Boy George! For the 15th year in a row, I think. Yes, yes. They, they might as well rename it the Anton Deck Award. Yeah, Mr. Boy George. I'm here to present the TV presenter of the year, and here are the nominations. This first one, I'm afraid, does this one. It's the dog. Mr. Graham Norton! Mm -hmm. uh, this is Angry Otter. <laughs> Can you do that? Can you do that? Try it. It's good! It's good! This next one is also a slightly aggressive <laughs> otter. <laughs> Oh my god! Uh, myself and Johnny to channel our inner otter. This is a nice three shot. It's me. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! There's one king of celebrity, Big Brother. In my reign, Fake Town would be free. Yeah. Spice Girls would play morning, noon, and night. Yeah, just. And I would rightfully be just recognized. Don't quite get as a his appeal. To yeah. Just don't quite get Ryland's appeal, to be honest. Mel and Sue. For your last ever tech chow. 
It's one of Paul's recipes. Paul, any pearls of wisdom? No. No. Paul and Mary, your bungee jump awaits. Have a great time. Mary, the safety harness is there. Paul, we haven't bothered for you. Very much a single trip. You've got two hours to complete this challenge. On your marks. Get set. And for one final technical time break. Anton Decker. You're right. We need backup. Leave this to me. Ha 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 And the winner is... Come on. And and Yay! Well done, boys. 50th year in an effing run. Well done. This is amazing, amazing. Um, it's it, it, people said to us on the way in tonight. Oh, you know, does it get boring always getting awards? Of course it doesn't. No. Um, no. If anything, our gratitude has only grown does. over the years um, because you never quite know when you're never going to get it again. So, thank you so much to everybody who took the trouble to vote for us. We really, really, really appreciate, appreciate it. it. Um, yes. Yeah. Thank you. Um, Fifteen years in a row. It's getting a bit mental now. It's, it's, it's yeah. Thank you very much from the bottom of all. It's an we insane amount of people, time uh, on, on to all the win, shows that we to win with, an uh, award. Thank you to everybody I mean, who looks at that I take away on I'm a celebrity. Get me out of here. And of course, on Britain's Got Talent, thank you very much. We're only here because of their hard work. Uh, thank you to our fantastic management team, James Grant, who have had quite a week this week with the burning down of their building. Um, thank you very much, guys. Um, to our lovely wives, our supportive family, and our friends, and to you guys for voting for us year after year. We really appreciate it. Really appreciate it. Keep going as long as you want yeah. to. Thank you to ITV for your continued support, and a very special thank you to Peter Fincham, who will be leaving us very soon. We are going to miss you, Peter, after eight fantastic years. Let's get yeah. drunk tonight. Thank you so much. We're going to miss you. To the new guy, we can't wait to get started working with you. <laughs> <laughs> but Peter, we will miss you. Um, thanks again for all of your votes. We really appreciate it. Have a fantastic night, everybody. Good night. Thank you. Well done, boys. Good night. It's getting awkward now. Getting awkward. Yeah. Time for international. The presenter, a man, will be any woman's. Ideal okay. First day, international series uh, French, now. He serves great food. He runs. He boxes. Really He's got enviable facial hair. Surely no one can be that perfect. Let's find out for ourselves. Because the first dates. It's a fucking game of thrones Press after all. And but also the big bang theory, unfortunately, is nominated. Hopefully that great pronunciation, Mr. Orlean. Great pronunciation. That's it. Thank you. So, without further ado, the nominations for international are. Here we go. The Big Bang Theory. God, please no. Orange is the new black. Never watched it. Game of Thrones. It's a dead sir, I think. And the National Television Awards goes to The Big Bang Theory. What? Uh, now, unfortunately, The Big Bang Theory can't be no. here tonight as they were making more Fucking Big Bang right now in the LA studio. Uh, in the event of a win, they've sent this message. It's quite a straightforward message. So, Fred, you think you could read that for us in French just to uh, kind of jazz it up a little bit? Yeah. Merci à nos fans pour avoir voté pour uh, The Big Bang Theory. Merci. 
And apparently, I'm very happy to um, to get this award on their behalf. Yeah, and then you just take that home with you because I should have been here in the first place. Take it to them. Right? Fuck yeah. this yeah. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. Lucky man, the best secret, and of course the much anticipated return now. of cold. And um, three shows to go alongside three very and, important um, new names. And Please welcome James Nesbitt, um, um, OBE. I've been really happy yeah. for, for David Tennant to win this for Broadchurch. But since oh, Dr. Foster won um, uh, Best New Drama um, early tonight, as Dermot said, I'm I've here now to got a really good for, feeling uh, that either he here to or that Sarang 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 is going to take. Uh, so, so for um, me, it's really between it's a really high between team, a Sarang and of a thriller. The grabs really. you from the first minute and doesn't that go? That was the mail. Uh, the Radio Times says about Lucky Man. James Nesbitt can, oh, they've left the OBE out there. Uh, James Nesbitt OBE can do no wrong. Their words, not mine. I mean, no, I'm not <laughs> here to talk about Lucky Man, 9 o'clock, Sky yeah. 1 Friday night. I am here to present uh, the awards Plus to was in the, the best uh, drama performers as a for extraordinary nominations. <laughs> and here they are. Saran Jones, That's Dr. Foster. Who I, that, I have a feeling that Saran is going to take this for Dr. Foster. If so, um, I think I'd be happy about this because it's, it's really surprising to me how well Dr. how well Dr. Foster has done, has done to, has, how well, how well, um, sorry, how well, um, uh, Dr. Foster has done um, tonight, so... She was a same age as my daughter. Mm -hmm. I can still feel the weight of her. Water dripping off her clothes all down me. Sort of personal leaves a child, Sharon Smith, black work. Mm -hmm. She won last year for, um, for her role in Scylla. I still haven't got that on DVD yet. Yeah. What was he doing here? Been wanting to get it, but. He's nice to me, but two been... old years, I didn't even know who he was. But I was a bit busy last year, so I'll try and make an effort, more of an effort, this year to either watch it or get it on DVD. I found it, sir. In one of the chests in the library. You dare to go rifling through those things? I'm sorry, sir. He never told me I shouldn't be Surely that was obvious. You're employed as a maid. I know, sir. And you've been a good one. And for that, you're allowed certain liberties, but dressing up in fine clothes is not one of them. I meant no arm, sir. It's just rotten away in that Take old box. Off. And I thought maybe you might let me wear it. Take it off now! You'll take it off. This minute you can pack your things and go back to your father. Here we go. Let's see what happens. Four extraordinary performances from four extraordinary actors. The National Television Award goes, goes to... To Saran Jones. Yes! Well done, Saran. Um, we didn't go, so if anyone from the group wants to 
email how to give birth or tips on labour, that would be quite useful. Um, <laughs> thank you so much to Drama Republic um, for being supportive and collaborative, uh, to the BBC for commissioning a relationship drama and believing in it, um, to the wonderful cast and crew um, who are talented and genuinely lovely people, and Mike, I share this with you, Mike Bartlett, our writer, for creating a truly complex character for me to inhabit. Um, thank you. I'm going to take my shoes off. Have a wonderful night. Take care. I'm really happy about stop, this stop, result. Stop, stop. Okay, oh, wow. guys. Here is the award for you know, best you know, factual it's with me, it's entertainment with program we have now. Around here every day for and months. I'm really we hoping that Gogglebox wins this for time. the second so and high back. hopes. Things are a and I have better, high hopes that Gogglebox so, wins this for the second good, year in the a row. The nominations for factual entertainment show are... Take it away, Jamie. DIY SOS. The mm -hmm. ring bill set to work in John's got. Oh, yeah, see the prince there and play this thing. The ring's in work. The learning. <laughs> if you want to learn, then stay and watch. Yeah. Yeah. Nick, I think yours is a bit weak. What's that? Pause there. That's yours. Look at this. Look, look, that's perfect. That looks absolutely immaculate. I can't believe it. I'm unbelievable. <laughs> this is the first time you've done this, isn't it? No, no, actually, yes, if I don't get enough from you lot, I, I, as soon as we get the VIP in, I'm getting it as well. We got the same name. <laughs> Tell them what her name is. Prince of Darkness. There you go. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Top Gear. Top Gear. Usual cost to round up 4,000 cows. This is a remarkably brave cow. He won't be pushed back it's into the line at all. It's a shame well, Jeremy Clarkson, James May and Richard Hammond are not, are never going, are not going stubborn. to do this show anymore. I shall call him James I mean, May. He fears it, the it, it, more. It's really the end of a near As it turned out, that top wasn't gear. entirely It really accurate. is. He's headbutting me. <laughs> He headbutted your Datsun. <laughs> Paul O'Brien, oh, for the love oh, of Jones. Here goes with the big cell. Does it like him? Um, as a it's a match still quite It is a lovely garden for the wonderful temperament. <laughs> Beamer, Beamer, she's talking to you. My favourite goggle box. Do you like Rita Aura? Do you like Rita Aura? Oh, huge mouth. <laughs> Hello, what's your name? My name is ah. Papacidro. Papacidro? Papacidro? Where are you from, Papacidro? I come from Rome, Italy. Oh! <laughs> I'm from Rome, Italy. Italy. Italy, I come from Rome, Italy. <laughs> I flew all the way from Rome and then... <laughs> <laughs> Must have took them hours then. <laughs> Please, Google Box. Okay, so, if Top Gear do win, who's going to pick up the award? Evans, Clarkson? Oh, that's tough. That's security. Okay, let's have a little one. The National Television Award goes Three, to... Google Box. Yes! Really happy about this result. Get in there. Second year in a row, the show is more than support. Yes. yes! Wow. Um, <laughs> this is pretty insane, to be honest. I mean, obviously. <laughs> I mean, I. 
we just sit at home and watch TV, to be honest, and to be in front of all you guys is <laughs> incredible. I mean, to be part of a night where I saw Dustin Hoffman tributing uh, Billy Connolly was pretty incredible. So yeah. all I can say is thank you to the voters who keep voting for us. That's yeah, two years running. It so was. Thank you so much. So thank you. Well done. Oh uh, yeah, good evening everyone. Um, watching TV is one of the easiest things anyone can do, but making a TV show about people watching TV is considerably more difficult. And, uh, and, on, and on that yeah. note, I just have to thank the makers of Gogglebox, everyone behind the show. Yeah, for it, making really, it, so, uh, it really is a tough job to do. Uh, and, and relevant, really. So uh, thanks to Studio Lambert and to Channel 4. I would just like to say a few words. Thank you so much, everyone here. This is really something quite unique for us. And I thank NTA for inviting us here. But the real uh, people who wants to take credit is all of the um, Gogglebox families and each and every member of them, because they bring unique and quirky sense of humor into this to entertain everybody. So really big thanks to them for that. Thank you so much. Yeah. And for us, really, we are humble folks here. This is a great honor to be here among sort of really cream of the British television uh, how the, the people here. So we have, um, virtually you can tell I'm speechless, really. So thank you so much <laughs> for that. Just going on the fact that the other Gogglebox members who are obviously couldn't make it, everybody couldn't make it here. But then, obviously, they do apologize for not being here tonight. But they do that like, because they're very busy doing something very important, watching this program. So thank you so much for that. Yes. Ah. Uh, right, here we go, guys. The final award of the night, which is for best talent show. And I'm really hoping Strictly Come Dancing trumps the X Factor to win this Good evening. Uh, thank you so much for inviting us tonight. It's my first time. Really? Uh, and also, I thank you very really much. Absolutely fantastic. Thank you. Us. Anyway, moving on. And I don't swiftly. think it's going the nominations to end for anyway, talent show are because, oh. because because the red teams for it have consistently the tanked uh, this past year. The X Factor. Yeah. Because 2015 has been a really shit year for the X-Factor. So, it, I don't, but it's not going to win. And the it. National Television Award goes, goes to... Strictly Come Dancing! Yay! Yeah. Take that, X-Factor. Fucking take that. And um, <laughs> if you want to know my um, thoughts on the X Factor, I've got a, um, a little um, rant video, a little rant video on the show um, um, in the pipeline. Oh my goodness! For this Thank you so channel. much to every so single person who took the time and the trouble to vote for, for us. That. It really does mean the world to us because there wouldn't strictly wouldn't be the show that it is if you weren't watching so thank you so much for voting oh my goodness and just a couple more thank yous the wonderful Claudia she couldn't be here tonight because she's working but we love you Claude and um, thank you to our incredible professional dancers who just take our breath away week after week mm -hmm. and our brilliant judges uh, thank you to our genius producer, Louise Rainbow. I guess this is why, I guess this is why Simon and Cheryl couldn't attend the night because, because they knew, because they probably knew that the X Factor was going to lose. Just a quick word. 
This is honestly, you know, such a hotly contested category. And, you know, when I was on oh. the X Factor, was either Strictly or the X Factor. Do you, when you come up, when you, you know, when the, the awards uh, and the nominations go out, do you always think you're in with a shot? Do you, you know, do you, do you, do you go with ratings or? Do we go with ratings? Not at all. No, we don't, because we can't predict the outcome on the mm. night. And it's, it is tricky. There's a lot of good shows in this category. So we sit there. Unlike Simon, wrecks, who's until all the very about. End of the night. Unlike Simon. And it feels really good with when you've got what you had. Simon Cowell, who's got a huge inflated ego. Kind of like and, and has an obsession. Like you are, you're almost like a stable match. Have an oh, obsession. Want to get and so I mean, right. how much does this mean to your team now? It means so much to us. We've had. Uh, is this our third national television award mm. in how many years our 12th year this year so in 11 years so yeah it really does mean a lot because it means it's voted for by the viewers at home and they make or break a show and the fact that they care enough to pick up the phone or to go online and vote oh peter andre is there thank you so much, thank you so much. and that is it congratulations yeah. to all you thank said it dermot that and um that is that so it's been a really really interesting night tonight it really has um um really surprised that that well, Dr. Well, Foster did well. Um, really gutted that that night that Doctor Who nor Broadchurch won virtually nothing. Um, but apart from that, but apart from that, most of the results I'm I'm really happy with. It's been a, it's been overall a really fantastic night tonight, and that's really all I have left to say. So, uh, please feel free to leave a comment in the section below, and uh, please let me know your thoughts on the results of the National Television Awards 20. 2016 tonight plus feel free to subscribe to my channel as always do take care everyone and bye bye